The total was fifty-seven twenty-two. Feels a bit like a ripoff. Get naked. It can't be any worse. Here we go. Here we go. Oh, looks good. Uh, Hi guys, it's Adria. Welcome back to my lovely YouTube channel. Don't be a sad panda. Don't be sad. Make over a bathroom instead. Before we begin, make sure to like up the video and subscribe if you haven't already. I try to post at least once a week. Today's shout out goes to Amber Frost. Thank you, Amber, for suggesting that I do this video. You motivated me. Let's get into today's video, which is a bathroom makeover. Where did this all begin? Brandon and I feel this like sense of embarrassment with our apartment. Recently, I heard Brandon remarking more and more about our bathroom, so I thought, Oh, wouldn't it be fun to make over the bathroom? Why did I pick a Florida theme? Well, as y'all know, my husband, Brandon, is from Florida. Give Brandon a little piece of home while he's taking a dump. I don't know. I was trying to keep the bathroom theme a surprise, but I accidentally spilled the beans. But he hasn't seen the stuff that's going in it. He hasn't seen any of this. I really drew a lot of inspiration from this collection of pictures I found on Facebook of this house. I would describe it as retro, pastel, little bohemian, lots of plants. It's very colorful. There's like some neon lights. There's like a big yellow fridge. If my apartment could look exactly like this, I would be set. I wanted to do a bathroom makeover on like a 50-ish dollar budget, but it actually ended up being probably about a hundred dollar budget in the end, but that's not bad. I'm gonna show you guys me shopping on Amazon, Brandon and I going to Target and finding some more things for the bathroom. Then at the end, we're really gonna put it all together and we're gonna surprise Brandon with it. <laughs> all right, so first and foremost, let's cut to the footage of me shopping Amazon. I look so bougie with my Michael Kors wallet, but I got this for $2 at a garage sale. I have my $50 Amazon gift card. So I think I'm gonna try to stay within the $50 budget. I think shower curtain is the big priority. Maybe like a cute trash can. I wanna incorporate like palm, maybe a flamingo type thing, oranges. I don't know. I'm gonna see if anything speaks to me. Orange shower curtain. Maybe I should look up oranges. Like this isn't really, <gasps> this is it. Oh, it's $19. That's like almost half of the gift card though. We'll add to cart. It doesn't hurt. <gasps> Ooh, with like a flamingo soap dispenser. All oh, those little shower curtain rings. That is so fun. I love that. What the freaking frick? <laughs> Why are they like doing yoga? Okay. Oh, I kind of love that flamingo shower curtain. Honestly, shower curtains are more expensive than I thought. Why did I think they were gonna be like $10? Oh, I'm sorry, my computer is a virus. That curtain's cute. I love that a lot. If it was palm trees instead of cactuses, I feel like I would take this one. <laughs> Get naked, bitch. <laughs> like, okay, pervy flamingo. <gasps> Look at the flamingo succulent planter. Do we need to add that to cart? On the back of the toilet? We'll see what happens. So, so far $37, okay. I, you know, I'm challenging myself with the $50 budget. I'm obsessed, look at this one. Okay, <laughs> like why are these so much money? I am so frugal, it's painful. When I was a kid, I really wanted those toilet seats that had the fish in them. I would have sold my soul to Satan to get one. Let me see if fish toilet seat. That's like the idea, but I feel like it was blue. <gasps> Is this it? 150, now I know why I never have one of these. Should we just say screw the budget and just do it? <laughs> why is adult stuff so freaking boring? Oh my gosh, be a pineapple, stand tall, wear a crown and be sweet. Okay, I am turning into a boomer. Wash your hands and say your prayers because Jesus and germs are everywhere. My mom literally got something like that for my sister for her bathroom. Tropical palm leaves, hand towel, florals or something, bath towel, highly absorbent, multi-purpose bathroom. For the palms of your hands. <laughs> Shopping actually kind of gives me like indigestion. Oh, and these are bad reviews. I was like, oh, this wicker best, $43. Yeah, never mind. It's not gonna work. Tropical wall art. The pineapples in the sunglasses are amazing. I don't know, this is like, uh, I hate buying stuff. Ooh, 
I know I'm being cheap here, but let's see my cart. Is it too much flamingos, do you think? I think I need to rethink the towels. Because I like the little pop of flamingo, like the little pot. I don't think that's too much. I want it to be not so cluttery. I think I'll do a fun soap dispenser. Like, should I just get this? It looks really nice. We'll add it to the cart. Who cares? <laughs> Proceed to check out four items. Four freaking items. Wow, my total is 33 cents. <laughs> Not bad. Cool. Target haul. So Brandon did end up getting the shower head. If you were wondering. I did find a basket. This was toward the front of the store and it had no price on it. And I'm like, if it's more than $10, I don't want it. And it was 20. Oh, we should do another video of us returning that. <laughs> I'm gonna put the washcloths in. That'll be nice. And we got a shower liner. We got a stopper for our drain. And the total was $57.22. Which feels a bit like a rip off. I can't believe those. $20. I, I feel bad. I'll literally give you $20 because I feel bad. <laughs> yeah, it's supposed to be your remodel. So the stuff has arrived. <laughs> so we got the little flamingo planter. It actually did not come with a plant in it. But luckily, my mom had little baby succulents that we put in here. Actually, my mom helped me fix a lot of this stuff as I will show you guys. Then we got the soap dispenser. This is like, I'm pleasantly surprised with this. It's bigger than I thought it would be. It's not cheapy. I like it. Probably my favorite thing is the shower curtain, which I haven't opened yet. So then the prints that I ordered, that was what they were, were prints. I thought maybe they would be on like canvases that you could just hang. No, I mean, they're cute. I like them, but it didn't really help me. So yesterday my mom and I ran to the dollar store. We got some frames. So the first one, I think this looks, this looks really good. So the four prints were like eight bucks. So that's like $2. So this is like a $3 thing. Are you kidding? So then my mom had a brilliant idea to get a bigger frame and we picked out wrapping paper and we put one of the prints in here. Like what? This is so cute. It's going to feel like Florida. So my Nana found, she runs like this garage sale in a box of donations they received. She found this. I don't get it, but it has sunglasses on. It's funny. Like I, I, I love it. I actually picked this up at a garage sale like a year or two ago, but it was in my kitchen and I thought maybe I could use this on back of the toilet or on the sink, but it's just this little Florida tray. I already had this bath mat, but I'm gonna use this. My mom got me this little shower mat. This is like super absorbent and see the teal. We got all the teal going on. Love, love, love. For Brandon's birthday this year, I actually got him this Florida candle and it's been sitting back here behind me, but I'm like, I need to put this in the bathroom. Like I need to put this in the bathroom, right? I thought I could hang Brandon's old license plate. Now I know this is like kind of dirty. It's kind of weird and gross, but it's, it's like what? But you know, it's literally a Florida license plate and it's kind of like shabby chic. And I'm really excited to do this. So now we are going to head to the bathroom. We're gonna clean. We're gonna take that ugly old shower curtain down. Look, my mom gave me that. It was an old curtain she had. I, I, I don't wanna curtain shame her, but like it's, it was cute. 10 years ago. <laughs> it makes the bathroom really dark. I'm excited to brighten up the space and just make it feel intentional. And at the end, we will have Brandon coming home from work and seeing it for the first time, which I'm I'm so excited about. <laughs> ah! Let's do it. Bathroom makeover, bathroom makeover, bathroom makeover, bathroom makeover. This is the transition music. Bathroom makeover, bathroom makeover, bathroom makeover. Let's mop this ish. Let's get this curtain down. If I can figure this out. It's kind of short, but I think it'll be okay. <laughs> oh my God. I am obsessed with this. All right, let's get her in. I think I'm done. Yeah, but guess what? Yeah. 
The bathroom is all done. Are you excited to see it? Yes. It actually didn't take me that long. It only took like a half hour to like set everything up. Oh, really? All right, see you when you get here. Are you ready to oh, see the yeah. potty? I'm ready to see the potty. It can't be any worse. Here we go, here we go. Oh. Ah, oh, you put my license. <laughs> <laughs> Don't get the license plate in the frame. Oh, it's cute. Good you job. like it? I do, I do. Look I like it. Look back there. I like it. I love the pineapple. Was Thank it what you. you expected? Yeah, kind of. I didn't expect the license plate. That's cute. Thank you. I like the flamingo. Thank you. Thank you. Bye. <laughs> Thank you guys for watching this bathroom makeover extravaganza. That didn't even take a lot of effort. Like just a little bit of effort completely changed this room. 10 out of 10 recommend would do again. I will see you guys again real soon. Until then, and hugs. Love you guys. Goodbye.